What's up guys, in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to make malfunctioning vending machines in Fortnite Creative. Now this is really easy to do, make sure to like and subscribe if you find this tutorial helpful, but let's just get straight into the video. So first you just want to get a place down a vending machine, and as you can see it has a question mark and that's what we want for the malfunctioning vending machine. You could do a billboard and put an exclamation mark like the real ones, but the question mark's fine. So the only thing you want for the vending machine is to put, um... Enable the game start to know so they can't interact with it at all. Next, you're going to want to get a conditional button, and the settings are can be used by all, interaction time, one second, or whatever you want. I'm just going to put one second. Color, you can put red or orange, but you can do whatever you want. Interaction text, I put receive random item because that's what's on the actual malfunction of vending machines. Alt display icon, uh, exclamation mark. Key items required, this is how much gold you want the person to use, I put 100, visible during games, hologram only, or you can do, um, so you can have the back bit as well, but I've just done the hologram only, because I think it looks a little bit better. Interaction target size, you're going to want to put this to 2 meters, so it's bigger than the vending machine, so they don't interact with the vending machine. And when activated, transfer on any three channels, so I've got channel 1. Then you're going to want to drop in just one gold into it. And however much you put the um, key items required, that's how much gold is used up. Then take it off and put a 32 grid strap on and just place it in around the middle of the vending machine and make sure the blue circle covers the whole vending machine. Next, fly somewhere outside of your map and just place down an item granter. And the settings you're going to want are on ground action key pool, give extra ammo no, cycle behavior wrap and cycle to random item assume from the same channel that's on the conditional button, so for me it's channel 1. Then you're just going to want to place any weapons or items you want into the vending machine, so I'm just going to do all the um, exotics for this example. Now let's start the game, test it out. So um, I've got some gold, I've got 500, and as you can see, if you walk up to the vending machine, you can't actually interact with it, you can only interact with the conditional button, and it says receive random item, and if you um, press and hold that, as you can see, it removes 100 gold from my inventory, and now I've got a random weapon. Now this time I've got um, a burst quad launcher, this time I've got um, a nighthawk, this time I've got a burst quad launcher, and finally I've got um, another false rifle. As you can see it says missing items gold and I can't interact with this anymore. And that's how you make a malfunctioning vending machine in Fortnite Creative. If this tutorial did help you out make sure to like and subscribe for more Fortnite Creative tutorials just like this. Check out one of these videos on the screen now. Thanks for watching the video guys. Peace.